let's have a look at question one in this video so we have a company that employs two employees and they want to introduce team production now every employee receives a base salary a and a bonus based on his production now the production is given over here the quantity produced of an individual we can see that it depends on the effort where v is the ability of the individual e is the effort now we have the utility function of one individual and what do we see here it depends positively on the wage of how much the guy earns plus gamma times the wage of the other person so he cares positively about the other person whether the other person receives more money his co-worker receives more money this guy is happier and then we have a negative dependence on the effort and the idea is that effort is costly it's, it's hard to work hard so to speak so that the utility decreases when we work hard now under this wage scheme what would be the optimal production so how do we solve this to find out the optimal production we need to know the optimal effort because production as we saw over here depends on the amount of effort so that would be the first step let's write the utility function in terms of the effort so that we can solve it first of all we write the utility as it is it is the wage plus gamma times the wage of the other individual minus 1 over 2 times theta times the effort to the power of 2 now what do we know about the 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 wage the wage has a base salary so it's a base salary plus a bonus based on production so plus b times quantity of the individual okay so let's write that the utility will be equal to a plus b times the quantity of the individual plus gamma times the wage of the other person minus 1 over 2 multiplied with the cost of effort of that individual what we also know is that the quantity produced this q is also given to us that's v multiplied with e so we will substitute that into the utility function we will have a plus b multiplied with v multiplied with the effort plus gamma multiplied with the wage of the other individual minus 1 over 2 times theta e to the power of 2 now we have utility depending on the effort because we have the effort in this term over here and we also have it in this term over here so to find out to find out the optimal effort we need to differentiate the utility with respect to effort and make that equal to zero now and by the way by the way a quick a quick intuitive thought here about why this is the case because if we look at the utility function depending on the effort we can see that it's a quadratic function a quadratic function with a negative coefficient in other words if we would plot this on a graph the utility and the effort so this would be the utility this would be the effort then the relationship would be would lo would look like that would look like a parabola so the maximum point would be on the peak of the graph and the peak of the graph has a slope at derivative equals to zero that's why we are solving the utility derivative equals to zero now let's differentiate the utility with respect to effort we start differentiating every term a is just a constant so the derivative is zero then this term over here b times v times e derivative with respect to e is going to be just b multiplied with v plus gamma times the wage if we differentiate this it's also zero because it's a constant and then over here what we have minus one over two times theta times the derivative of e to the power of two so we will have minus one over two times theta times two e equals to zero now let's let's write this in a bit of a better way so we'll have b times v and then two and two cancels out so minus because plus and minus turns into a minus theta multiplied with e equals to zero now let's solve for the effort because that what that's what we're looking for let's do it over here we will have that b multiplied with v equals to theta multiplied with the effort now what's going to be the effort the effort of the individual the optimal effort so to speak will be b multiplied with v divided by theta now this is just the effort the question is about the output but we know that there's a relationship between the optimal effort and the output because the output as we saw in the question is equal to v multiplied with the effort so the output the output of the individual the output of the individual q like that is going to be equal to v multiplied with the effort and that is our effort so multiplied with b times v divided by theta so that's equal to that's equal to b multiplied with v to the power of 2 divided by theta and what we can see over here is that we only have b times v divided by theta so the answer is false hope this makes sense and we are done